Hey, what's up everyone? Ryan here and today I'm back with another PGA 2K23 course showcase video and we're diving into the new course Cornucopia from the great designer Il Malahan. This is a beautiful coastal golf course and I am so excited to showcase this one to you all today. As always, get on out there in game, play this course and let me know how you shoot in a comment down below. Let's see who can get the best score on the channel. So for today's round of golf, we're gonna be diving into the course from the back tees the back tees to the black tees playing 7,211 yards. Going to be playing pin location number four today. So the Sunday pins, high winds, all the rest, the designer default conditions. This is going to be a fun one. Let's go ahead and dive on in. If you all get some enjoyment, be sure to drop a like. That really helps the channel. Subscribe for more. There is plenty more sports game content, including more PGA 2K23 content here on the Gamer Ability YouTube channel. Tons of career mode content. You you like career modes? This is the channel for you. Uh, the I will say, the Impossible Rounds series we've been doing on Friday, visiting other Impossible Rounds courses, have been a blast. Be sure you check that out on Friday mornings each week. But here we go. We get to the first tee. Just a beautiful view. You had the houses on the hill and the backdrop. That kind of fall color fill. This to me, it fits the fall season, the autumn season with the way the bushes are colored, the, the red trees at different points, the uses of orange as well. You know, maybe some people, not everybody would call it fall because obviously there's not a lot of red and orange courses. There's just like a few of them thrown in there. But it, for me, just the color aesthetic does remind me of fall, especially of the bushes and the surrounding areas. But we take a look at this, we move behind us, that's the coastal part of this course. That's my favorite part. And this course has a great variety of coastal golf holes and also golf holes more not on the coast, right? More the inland holes. But these golf holes right here, this one, this golf shot is absolutely insane because, I mean, as you can see, the way it's sculpted there. But if you hit this far and bake it off that slope, that ball is going in the water. Uh, not saying that from a personal experience, obviously. I would never hit it in the water. Uh, but this is one of my favorite golf holes here. I love this shot over the hills, over the rough, right over onto the green. It's so sneaky, though, this course, because there's so many spots. This is one of them that O'Malahan put in here. Uh, so you see this. If you hit it far... The back slope is bound, is sloped away, which carries you into this little ravine or water bunker. Yeah, Il Malahan's really tried to trick us out there on the golf course. I want to point these spots out to you so you all don't make the same mistakes that other golfers make, right? Uh, but yeah, this is just a beautiful plot of land. I love the different colors and aesthetics used here. It is absolutely gorgeous. Reminds me of a, like a early fall course you know like it's the seasons beginning to change the trees are starting to change but it is just gorgeous the way this course wraps around the coast there is water and play everywhere so make sure you bring plenty of golf balls but look at that sculpting the drone view here really gives the appreciation to just how well done the sculpting is look where my cursor is at the bottom of the screen the detail in the hills, the rocks, everything looks so natural. Like everything looks so purposeful and beautifully sculpted on this golf course. It is insane. Malahan is on another level and Malahan has done it again, everybody. I'm ready to dedicate some good golf shots to Malahan. I don't think I've ever dedicated better than a par. That changes today. We're going to hit 90% fairways and dedicate three birdies with a bonus eyes closed birdie dedication. I want to finish the aerial view because you all got to see this view with the sunset lighthouse in the background. Breathtaking. This golf course is truly exceptional. Beautiful design. The golf is great. Let's get on out there and play some golf and see if we can score well, well here. Big thank you to Malahan for designing this beautiful course. Let's play some golf. Yeah, so yeah, what did I say? Did I really say 90% of fairways? And three birdies and a, oh, a bonus. Okay. Just a pure swing. Just a pure swing. What can we say? We better hope it's pure after. <laughs> 
I haven't dedicated a par to Malahan, and today I'm saying three straight birdies and a bonus eyes close 90 fairways. Okay, about 175 yards to go here. Yeah, okay. I've never even done that in my dreams. <laughs> usually in my dreams, it's more of a nightmare when it's, uh, it's usually me playing Central Park. I wake up. And I'm, I'm dreaming I'm playing Central Park again, attempt number 1,000. I'm like, no, I beat Central Park. No, you're still here, Ryan. Then I wake up. It's like, oh. I go to YouTube, check attempt 66. It's like, okay, that happened. Wipe off the sweat. <laughs> 176, uphill 24. Central Park. We're never returning. We're sending this. Some of you might be wondering what Central Park don't worry about it. <laughs> don't ask questions you don't, you're not ready to hear the answer to, Nothing right? With that, safely on it is a green. golf course. Careful with this one. This is from where? That we were there for over a year for a challenge on Fridays. That's all I'm going to say about that. 35 footer, downhill three inches. Going to move left to right at the beginning. It comes back. We can make this. I pulled it. Yeah, there's no way. A pulling that took out that beginning break, a lot of it, and then, yeah, it was never going to turn that much. Oh, man. That would have been something. Thanks, right, John. For the par. Would have been something. You are currently sitting Hopefully right that's not the, the name of Ryan Gamer's autobiography. You know, I talk about his autobiography across all the sports. Hopefully We're that's not the name of it. We got a headwind on this hole. 362-yard par 4 here. Look at this Beautiful golf hole. See what I'm saying about the the autumn or fall feel? It's like the course is beginning to change. The colors are starting to change. Like early fall. One of my favorite seasons of the year. It is just such a beautiful time of the year. The weather feels great. Beautiful. Beautiful swing. And just like that beautiful swing John said. These designers in this game, I know I say this every time, but they're on another level. Like, the designs Here's are just our second shot on hole number two. perfect. I usually struggle at Malahan's courses. I will say that. Malahan's courses usually are on the more difficult side for me anyways. 112, downhill 14. Let's go gap wedge, a little bit of loft, and then attack this. It's, it's downhill. Going to come off to the right. This is a tricky shot. That's beautiful. We need the wind to grab it. So it was a cross headwind. At least it seemed like it. It mostly played like a straight side wind and really picked up distance off that downhill slope. Sweet. Okay, 25 footer to go. Did John just say sweet? And that's all he said? I don't know if I've ever heard him say that. Sweet. 25 feet uphill 5 inches. Well, left to right. Oh my goodness. Oh my Isn't goodness indeed, John. But I have to say, aren't we hitting fairways? I said 90%. Have we work. missed a fairway yet? No. And that's going to keep you at even par. Yeah, I got two cups of coffee with me today. Don't you all worry. Cheers. This Careful one's almost there. Uh, over. But... Right on this hole. Wow. Look at this view. Are you kidding me? Sculpting is so well done here. It's so natural. The planting is just gorgeous. Can we get a view of the lighthouse over here? Uh, not really through the trees, though. It's it's much further to the right. We'll see it on the next hole, I think. 412, downhill 26. Uh, can you send this? This is a trap, right? <laughs> well, is it? Because to the right looks like more of a trap. Look at that cliff. There's no way. We have a better chance of aiming over here. Because look, the out of bounds, there's so much room over here. <laughs> look at all the room for activities on the left side of the fairway. And then look at the right side. There's no room for activities over there. It's out of bounds. So I'm going... I'm not falling for Malahan's trap. I am sent... Wait, that is Malahan's trap to send it, right? Now that I think about it. What's Malahan's trap? Is it the right or is it the left? 
I think they're both a trap. Pretty sure we're heading to the bunker here. Speaking of a trap, we're in the sand trap. Uh, so yeah, I think both of them are tricky. I don't okay, know what you're do supposed this. to do there. Out of Pull out a hybrid, probably. Yeah, be smart. It's course management, which I did not have there. But yeah, look at... Why didn't I think of that? We could have hit like a hybrid and had 150 to the green. What's the fun in that, though? We're the tour guide of the course. I've got to show you all the fun routes. You all need to know what not to do. That's my goal of these showcases. So you, when you play the course, you're like, okay, what did Ryan do? Okay, let's do the opposite this time. Oh, what did Ryan do on this one? Okay, let's let's hit it in the opposite direction. Or do that. Oh, that is wonderful. Nice shot. Yeah, that'll do. Tap this one in and let's move on. Never mind. We're right, here showing you what to, to do, believe it or not. Okay, that'll bring you down to oh, one under. Oh, my. We peaked. Get your coffee. Yeah, my okay, other one's kind of gotten cold. No, we're not three. wasting the rest of that coffee. Not getting the fresh cup over here. Yeah, I got I got a couple of them. We're drinking the rest of this. It's kind of gotten cold or lukewarm. I'm, I'm a fan of piping hot coffee, but it's all right. We don't waste coffee here on the Gamer Ability YouTube channel. <laughs> Doesn't matter the temperature. Are you all thinking what I'm thinking? What did I say? Three birdie dedicated this round, I said, right? No, I technically said four with bonus eyes closed. I need to think before I talk sometimes at the beginning of these videos. 167, downhill 27. Wind at her back. I look at this gorgeous view. Lighthouse in the background. Focus on the beauty on this shot. Well, focus on the beauty of the environment on this shot dedication. And I wouldn't pay too much close attention to the shot until you hear the sound of the ball going in the hole. But just look at this view. Let's just take this in for a second. The birds chirping. The water. Beautiful. Okay, here we go. Oh, I forgot. This one's for you, Malahan. That would have been bad. Going through some branches here. Why, why, why do I do the things that I do? That one's for you, Malahan. Hope you enjoyed it. Were you all, hey, you all were focused on the beauty. Nobody saw that. Hey, glad you all were focusing on the lighthouse, the this beautiful view. Third. Welcome back to Gamer Ability. We have a, uh, somehow we're hitting three here off the tee. I don't really know what happened there. Uh, but yeah, we're just going to dedicate this par ace. Malahan, I clearly miscalculated the wind on that one. Clearly. Miscalculated something, all right. And we're going right of the pin. Well, better luck next time. <laughs> and this is your fourth shot. <laughs> even know what to say i we're gonna go to the classic moment of silence i used to do after bad shot dedication so i'm not gonna say a word the rest of this hole i'll say it all with my facial expressions the pain Ooh, 
nice little chip on that one. Just a little three footer left for this one. Malahan, this double bogey's for you. Hope you enjoy it. Every designer's right, favorite. That'll go. And you're sitting at one over for the round. All right, ready to go here on the fifth hole. I always keep grabbing the fresh hot cup of coffee and change my mind because I got to finish this other one. It's almost done. It's done. It's the cold coffee. Okay, here we go. Let's get rejuvenated. <laughs> you can't make this stuff up. I was feeling so good. You all don't understand. I was striping them at the range. I mean, I'm talking about shot after shot of perfection. And some of you are like, Ryan, do you hit the range before a course showcase? Well, when I get serious, yeah. <laughs> Does it help? A little play. This one's about no comment. yards from the pin. Let's just focus on the golf. A beautiful view up that hill there. 98 yards left here. This golf course is beautiful. Let's focus on that. And let's let's bounce back. Look at the planting in the backdrop. Like that log cabin in the background. The trees changing colors there. The use of the brown trees. The red trees. The orange trees. And then the, the planting. Just gorgeous. Unreal. This one's a little to Please the right bounce on left. Approach. Well, it didn't really bounce left. Well, We're on the green. For now. We'll go down to even par if you think. How this. many points is a double bogey in stable for format, which is our sh shot dedication? That's zero. No. Wait, a bogey's one. At zero. Hey! Some might call that an even dedication. If they don't know what stable forward format is. It could be a good one. Yes! Let's what a bounce go. back. Come on. Look. It's just a birdie double bogey birdie sandwich. What could we say? And you're at even par currently. Gorgeous. Look well, at this view. It is absolutely stunning. Wow. 437, downhill 12. You hit the sin button. There's out of bounds to the left. You can't be afraid of Malahan. See, we don't fear Malahan, even though we sent that one out of bounds. We probably should, but what a golf shot. That was gorgeous. 356 oh, yeah. I'll, yard I'll, drive. I'll approve that. John right, approves. Elevated green. Might need some more club. 95 yards. We have a backboard. What about off the backboard, spin back into the hole? I think this one's looking good. Nice work. That... Okay, so this is just going to be one of those rounds right, when if I bird. say I'm going to do something, it's not going to happen. Which some might say, Ryan, that's that's every round. But I, I don't agree with that. Yes! It's a birdie. I do agree with that. It's that... Look... Cold cup of coffee led to a double bogey shot right, dedication. Fresh, hot thermos park. cup of coffee. This hole's a park back to back three. birdies. Does hot coffee make a difference? Well, stay tuned for the new tutorial video that's going to talk about the importance of hot coffee when you're playing PGA 2K23. Imagine. 187 yards, downhill 5 feet. 4 iron normal. You, you all know those tutorial videos that will say like, if you stay around to the end, I will even give you a bonus tip, like a special bonus tip that will take your game to the next level. And then you sit there and you wait the entire time. And at the end, it's just either they never get to it, they forget, 
or they say something that does not help you at all. Imagine. Hey, welcome to Gamer Ability. Ryan here. Uh, this this tutorial will change your life in PGA 2K23. Make sure you watch all the way to the end. You will get the most perfect bonus tip to improve your game of golf by exponential margins. And then me at the end, I'm like, so you're here for the bonus tip? Drink hot piping coffee. What a beautiful golf hole, though. Beautiful. You know I'm enjoying a course and having a good time when I'm just sitting here relaxed, talking to you all, telling life stories, talking about coffee, enjoying myself even after a double bogey into an out-of-bounds par 3. Like That's when you know I love a course. Just a nice, relaxed, beautiful fall course. Makes me want to go outside today, play some golf. I guess I should have saved my shot dedication for that, but that that was a firm bounce. Does Malahan put Pro concrete underneath the fine. greens? They are okay, 172, 19. so they are quick. 19 feet downhill one inch, just a little right to left. Oh, that was almost in. Here we go. Par putt coming up. That would be the perfect name of a book to describe golf. Almost in. Golf for beginners. Because that's what you're going to be. You're going to be there almost in, but you're never going to quite be there. That's, I just misread it slightly. I thought the beginning was going to break a bit more, but clearly it and didn't. One so under for the day. And now we're Look, hey, Doc the Caddy, she hole. made the trip today. She's telling Ryan, uh, just please hit the ball into the fairway. You said you're going to hit 90% of fairways. You already embarrassed me with that double bogey shot dedication to the great designer of this course. You better hit some fairways now. Okay. 315 downhill 20. Oh my. This is our best chance to dedicate a eagle. Malahan, wherever you are out there on the World Wide Web, gave us this beautiful aceable par 4. Full backspin. A little bit of loft. Oh my. Is that tree? No, that tree is not in play. Yeah, definitely not. That's an aim spot. Oh. <laughs> Come on. Okay, we have fun here on the Gamer Builder YouTube channel, don't we? It's all about having fun. That's what it's all about, everybody. Gaming should always be fun. And we have fun. You can definitely say that. Great swing on that one. That is perfect. Wind. No, oh, you're kidding. You're kidding. Where's this one going? I agree, Ryan. Look at virtual Ryan. Like, look at his caddy dog. Like, is that what you meant? Setting up for our third shot. Did I say that? Wait. Did I say that one's for you, Malahan? I did not. Did I say it? All I said... I don't think that's an official dedication. I do not think I declared... A sh Listen, we're, we're getting technical today on this showcase. We... I do not think I declared a shot dedication right before the shot. By the gamer ability bylaw created by myself for myself, I believe I did not declare a shot dedication. I just told you I just told you it was gonna be good and that this is gonna be a good one for Malahan, but I do not think that I said, Malahan, this one's for you, did I? We're getting technical here. I, I really don't know, did I? Our best chance for birdie. Okay, I did full backspin and full loft with the driver down the hill. I just don't... I don't understand what just happened there. But what do I know? Okay, that's exactly what I did, right? 
Yeah, Ryan, that's exactly what you did. <laughs> no, never mind. Oh, okay. Partial, right? I overpowered it. And this one's your yep. fourth. I, I must have hit 100 percent or more. That's unfortunate. Did I dedicate it? I wanna you all can let me know. I did I officially declare a shot dedication right before the shot. It's gotta be declared. You know, it's I can't say like, oh, I'm gonna dedicate this shot and then not say Malahan, this one's for you. Wherever you are out there on the world wide web is what I usually say. I don't think I said that. Six. I'm gonna I don't have a rewind button and I'm not gonna I'm not going to, like, stop the video, go put it on a video editor, and then check it out to Let's see. <laughs> All right, in the hole for the Bogue. I'm going to say I did not dedicate that one. I do not think I officially declared a shot dedication. That's when you know shot dedications are bad on the channel, when I have to have a specific bylaw of calling back a shot dedication. Point. We take it serious here on shot dedications. 594 down here 32. We only get three of them with one bonus. I usually don't break break that rule. Beautiful golf hole though. This is a gorgeous course. Like this is such a stunning view. And look at the lighthouse in the background. The way the lighting is. This is just a picture perfect golf hole. That was well played. This is a picture perfect golf course okay, though. I mean this is stunning. Yard area from here. Like, look at this. That is absolutely stunning. 229, downhill one foot, part five. Okay, see? Malahan, wherever you are out there, on the world, wide, world, world, worldwide, Malahan, Wherever you are out there, this one's for you. I can't even talk right now. <laughs> this chorus has beat me down already. But Malahan, this shot's for you. World Wide Web. That's the word. Get to the right, get to the right. You know, it's not out of bounds, so it's shot. way better than our official shot dedication and our unofficial one. This is our third technically shot dedication, but only two official ones by by the game ability bylaw. World Wide Web. Well judged. <laughs> I, on that I one. couldn't say it. Okay, this course has me so flustered right now. I can't even pronounce words right. Now, it's not nice like I pronounce... On that one. You know, I, I, pr I have a lot of, of unique pronunciations, right? One, this isn't grammar ability. So, like... Power. Yeah, and usually I pronounce that one right. On this, one's blowing right into our face. this is my favorite golf hole. This is, I would call, the signature hole. You know, there's a lot of signature holes... Signature views and holes on this course. But this one is just breathtaking. It is breathtaking. I would love a lighthouse over here, but, you know... The lighthouse is over there. They're just beautiful. I'm going to get a close-up view, too. What is that? Two official shot dedications. Wait, that was a birdie, right? I am so... Did I just glance over the fact we just birdied? What am I doing? Those out-of-bounds shots are really weighing in on me. Yeah, Malahan! That's uh, a double, zero points, a birdie, three points, so three points. An unofficial bogey dedication to, <laughs> some might call that a bogey save, you know? Because it was a good bogey. Here's that trick shot I was telling you about from the beginning. When I say trick shot, trick, bad shot. You do not want to go far here. I think that this hole is designed for platinum tour players on TGC tours as like a trick shot. I'm going for it, though. I know better than to dedicate this shot. I can tell you that right now. Ooh, Watch it go in. A kick to the left? Watch it go in. Watch it go in.
Watch yep, it row to 10 feet work. away. Great go, look at Birdie. One of the best looks at Birdie here on the day. It's getting there. And a bird! Come there on! Go, In there. Nicely done. I'm just glad we didn't hit it down that little water tunnel there. Don't hit it. Okay, Trust me. Do not do it. Two under par now after that one. Wind's blowing out there right to left. The news is, I feel like in this round, I've showed you all what to do, what not to do in different ways. You know, I feel like this is a very educational round of golf. You learned about the gamer ability bylaw for shot dedications too. You learned how to say World Wide Web. And what a beautiful par 4 here. A long par 4. You can go to the left or right. I'm going to go to the left. Tee shot's looking nice here. That's beautiful. And we're about, a, I don't know, 200 yards or so from the pin from here. Look how mean Malahan. Wow, somebody made Malahan mad on some of these golf hoes. Like, they said something about some of his other courses, like maybe one of them being too easy. So Malahan really put these slopes here by the green. You talk about risk, risk, risky shots. Malahan's not messing around. Now, I'm going to go for it. Plenty of green to work with here. No reason to lay up. I'm going to go four iron. I do like, I do feel like my swing is good today. There's been a couple really bad shots. Looks like this one's going left. We got lucky. Well, unfortunately, we missed the green here. There's an example of one okay, of the bad shots, the but I really shot. don't feel like the swing is that bad today, if I'm being honest with you all. I, I don't think so. Maybe... Maybe I'm wrong. Clearly, we're two under through 11, but it feels like we could be a lot better. I'm going to be quiet now. Nicely out of that rough. Now let's get into that green. All right, this is your fourth shot. No golf coach ever would tell you to talk the entire time while you're swinging, so you should probably s talk. Stop. Hit the shot and then start talking again, right? <laughs> There's another tutorial for you all in today's video. Okay, bogey. Don't talk during up. your shots. A mistake I make a lot. That'll do. That's a tough hole. And this is such a well-designed course. You talk about a course that is crushing us. And also we're scoring at the same time. It rewards good shots. It rewards precision, which is one of my downsides. My nemesis, of course, that requires precision. I usually struggle at. Uh, but yeah, get your coffee wherever you're drinking. That's we know it's a bogey. Sit that coffee down. <laughs> I guess I starting to celebrate bogeys now. What has this channel become? A nice looking shot. I'm gonna take a sip of water though. That, that's what hey, we drink water for bogeys, right? <laughs> yeah, that we deserve on water on bogeys. On the 12th. Bobby Boucher would not be happy. Bobby Boucher out there from Waterboy, you know. Bobby Boucher would be so mad if we're drinking coffee to celebrate birdies and bogeys for water for bogeys. Bobby Boucher would want that the other way around. Uh, what Bobby don't know won't hurt him, right? <laughs> I'm sending this. Oh my, I love water boy. Happy Gilmore 2 is in production right now, everybody. I hope it's good. I hope Happy Gilmore 2. I, I am so ready for it. Happy Gilmore, one of my all-time favorite movies. I hope Happy Gilmore 2 is good. I love Adam Sandler I guess you're so much. Take that driver off the fairway and, and I, be on your way. I want Happy Gilmore 2 to just be incredible. This design, nice, nice. like, this course this has it all. Shot. It's got the views. It's got the course management. It's got a lot of decisions, which goes in course management. 
It's got a lot of variety. Tough golf holes, short golf holes that are still tough because you want to send it and you end up hitting a non-official shot dedication out of bounds, but then you save bogey. So yeah, it's it's got it all. Let's send it. There's a great example. If you add a lot of shot shaping yeah, and you push shot. it just a little bit, tempo's just a little bit off. That ball is gone, and there's that that ball just went. All right. Just win in. Let's go, baby. Look at that scorecard. Birdie double, birdie, birdie, par, bogey. Birdie, bogey combination with a couple birdies on the back. Oh, my. Okay, checking in here. Two under par for the day. The scorecard right, disappeared as I was reading it there. The I forgot here. what we it's got in the last four holes, but I know we're playing good. Like, really good. Look at this. This is stunning. I cannot wait to see the different fall courses and Halloween courses this year. Anybody out there making a Halloween themed course? B Brusby08, listen. If you all did not play B Brusby08 Halloween course last year, play it. I think it's called, ooh, what's it called? Halloween Town? No. Oh, what's it called? I think it's just called Halloween. Yeah, I think it's just called Halloween. I could be wrong. Be brush BC rate. If you're out there, let us know in a comment. I um that's incredible. An incredible Halloween course. And I hope B Brush B does another one this year. It was a fun round. That's you can go back and watch the showcase of that thing. course. If you if you click on the course showcase playlist in the description below, you have to go back about a year. That, that would have been last well October. But it was such a good normal. course. I'm pretty sure it's just called Halloween. I'm going to send this. Yeah, I'm not afraid. Wait, 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 wait. Not afraid. We have a 59% lie. It's not a matter of fear, right? <laughs> it's a matter of making a smart decision. Actually, no. I. This is why we carry hybrids, right? Let's go hybrid. Put a little loft on it. So we get a better lie and just hope we one tin this down. It's on a down slope. It's going to carry out. We need a flyer's lie. Everybody one time for the flyer's lie. Okay. Well, That's pretty good. Like that. Back in the fairway. Let's let's take it from there. 49 yards. Gap wedge in hand. Into the wind. I think we go pitch. Pitch with loft. Not as much shot shaping we did last hole. Oh, that's beautiful. Lovely golf shot. You know, fall's a great time of the year. It's beautiful. Football season is in full force. All right, drop this on. Playoff baseball is almost here. The end of the baseball season. Hockey is about to start up. NBA is about to start up. It is one of my favorite times of the year. And pumpkin pie, one of my all-time favorites. My wife makes the best pumpkin pie. And speaking of pumpkin, my wife made homemade pumpkin muffins today. They were phenomenal. Oh, my what a legend that dog is. She is a legend. She can make anything. Those, but they were amazing. I ate like so five of so them good. already. I ate like five well, of them already done. today. Why? So why am I just so excited today? Telling life stories, having a good time. I've had five pumpkin muffins, three cups All of right, coffee, and I'm on my fourth cup of point. coffee today. So okay, <laughs> it's been a good day. On one, right to left. That sounds a bit, that sounds like I need to settle down on the coffee. It sounds like a bit too much, but hey, you know, it's just one of those coffee days. It's fall. 156, uphill four. 
Let's send it. What a beautiful view. We got a shot dedication left and a bonus eyes close. With this beautiful view, I don't think out of bounds is in play. Malahan, this ace is for you. I officially declared the shot dedication. It's official. This one's for you, Malahan. Let's do the intro better this time. Wherever you are out there on the World Wide Web, Malahan, this one's for you. Come on, ball. Kick to the right. As far as shot dedications go this round, that's an elite level shot dedication. And here we go, potential birdie. What are we at? Three points now. This would be the six points to save. I said I know. I said three. That's okay. We count that unofficial one. That's a bogey added to it, but we don't count that one. Well, the only one who can really attest to that is is Malahan. If Malahan comes across this video, Malahan can let us know. Did I officially dedicate that shot? To you, Malahan, in that moment was an official, official or unofficial shot dedication. We need to know Malahan's ruling on that. This is an official one. I'm talking about the bogey earlier. This one's for you, Malahan. Come on. Come on. Come on. No, oh, that's going right by the hole, isn't it? You know, I just love golf okay, so four much. Feet to go. And I just don't feel like it loves me back. You all feel that way tracking. sometimes? All right, in the cup for the par. That's two points, so we're up to five on the dedication. Now we can still do a bonus eyes right, close Albi. Right One of my favorite views on this course. I mean, the, the planting and sculpting in between is phenomenal. I feel like what Malahan did. Malahan went to the tee right here and would take a look. And Malahan would start placing different, different colors, different bushes. He would come back to the tee, take a look, and it's like, okay, we need more here. We need more here. And he kept doing that until he had this perfection. That might be what all course designers do. But the patience to be able to do that, I do not have. I don't, I don't have the patience, the, the vision to be like, oh, this. I may have the vision to say, like, this needs to be here. This needs to be here. But I couldn't actually execute it. You know, I have no clue what I'm doing in the designer. 546, uphill 50, send. Really nice swing. Thank you, John. That really was. Wow. Now we, a hey, we drink coffee to celebrate big time drives. Cheers, everybody. And this one's around 205 yards away. 205, uphill 31 feet. Four iron in hand. I'm going to do full backspin, a little bit of loft, and I'm going to send this. Oh, uphill lie. Okay. Okay, let's reset. Let's reset. I'm going to land this short. Normal, yeah, we're just going, we're going for the nice little Malahan path. We're going to go up onto the green, roll it from right to left, nice and slow, trickling all the way down, close to the hole. The designer route. There well, it is. A kick to the left. Trickle on down. Trickle on down, come on. I mean, it was great, do, but grab your putter. it didn't trickle on down, did it? Four under if this goes down. So when I saw that in my mind, I thought with 172 green speeds, they've been really firm. I really thought that one was going, but this is also the same, same, this is coming from the same guy who said I was going to hit four, three straight birdie dedications and eyes closed birdie added on to that with 90% fairways when my fairway average on the channel is in the 60s and my shot dedication scoring average 
in nor normal format is probably around 105 over par. And I think that might be an understatement. Under It might be well above over par than 105, but let's not go above that. Let's make this eagle, though. Oh, it could be. Right by the hole. Just three feet left. I... Nice work. That's birdie number yeah, seven. Yeah, uh, I mean... Malahan forgot After to put magnets in the cup. What are you going to do? It happens. Some designers forget to put the Ryan Gamer magnets. Yeah, this hole's a part four. Forge and 55, forge and 55 yard par four. I love the natural sculpting here. It looks amazing. This golf course is on another level. Malahan, what have you done? Perfection. I am sending this. I'm feeling good with this wind. Malahan has me fired up right now. Perfect. See, that's when you know I'm feeling good. Swing is there today. Decision making questionable. Distance yeah, control very questionable. Or so to the pin. Everything else pretty good. Imagine. What is this? A resort? Oh my. Could you all imagine? Anybody have a view like this in real life? Imagine staying at this hotel. Just being able to look out the window right here. Let's simulate that. We're in the hotel. We're looking out the window. Just imagine. And we can look out this side, side window to watch Ryan Gamer play. Look, Ryan Gamer's hitting to the green. This is, I don't know if this is an office, business, or hotel, but I imagine all the fans are in here up, up against this window watching Ryan Gamer, Gamer multiple time major champion, FedEx Cup champion multiple times here on the channel. He's won Stanley. He's never won a Stanley Cup. I take that back. He's won. <laughs> I forget what he's won. He's not won a Super Bowl. What has Ryan won? National championships for the Kentucky Wildcats. How am I forgetting this? What has Ryan won? The World Series multiple times. Wow. Sorry, Ryan, to let you down on that intro. But yeah, he's won a lot. Let's just say that. He's still looking for a Super Bowl, a Stanley Cup on the channel, a soccer championship as well. F1 championship, a NASCAR championship. What else? What are ones we haven't got yet, you two? We have a, my goal, honestly, I'm serious. With Ryan Gamer, before Come he retires on, right on the now. channel, I want him to win every single sport. What a golf shot. The fans who are watching in that building are fired Great up right now. On that approach. But yeah, I want to win every championship. We go, putt coming up. We've never won an NBA Finals. What have we won? A national championship for the Kentucky Wildcats as head coach. We've won multiple World Series. Two for the New York Mets. Ryan Gamer has won. One for the Cincinnati Reds. That one's special to me because that's my favorite team, as many of you know that. Uh, so, yeah, that was... Uh, what else? We've won multiple major championships. We're way. talking probably Birdie 12 or more major work. championships on the channel. We've won like three or four FedEx Cups. Four so a lot of golf tournaments. But up to a par I feel like I'm missing here. a championship on a sport. Uh, oh! Tennis! Yeah, we've never won a Grand Slam in tennis. We have won the tennis championship. We've won the ATP finals. We have won the tennis championship. But we, the ATP championship, we have not won a Grand Slam yet. So there's that. I need to tally up. I need to tally up one time and show it before I start every career mode series on the channel. I'm serious. I need to tally it up and show it every single time. Like, this is what Ryan Gamer has won. This is what he's still after. That would actually be awesome. But let's send this in. What a beautiful golf hole. Enough about Ryan's achievements. We're four under through 16. Get good, Ryan. <laughs> Multiple major championships, I bet. Somebody new to the channel is like, okay, I bet you've won multiple majors, Ryan. Nice swing on to that one.
That is lovely sculpting. I probably wouldn't, wouldn't have said that if I would have smacked it over the green off that left side slope 100 yards down that fairway. There, champ. But here's an 11 footer. I haven't forgot about the bonus eyes closed dedication. I want to make that abundantly clear. I'm sure Malahan gave us a very scorable, eagleable, albatrossable, aceable final hole. Ah. No. Just like he put the Ryan Gamer magnets into the I cups on this, this course. How many lip outs is that? And nice putt. Let's move on. And that will keep you at four under par. I didn't have my... I went to take a sip of coffee. Didn't have my lid on open. This, one, the wind is picked up this course has me right. all four up. Albatross ball is a strong word. For a 622-yard par 5. Uh, hey, it's downhill a lot. Look at this stunning view. This course is phenomenal. From start to finish, this is amazing. Look how beautiful the sky is in the background. I still get comments on my videos, my older videos, of people saying the, the clouds don't move. Yes, they do. Look, watch. My cursor is here. Watch. My cursor is here. There's no clouds here. Watch as we keep the cursor there. You see how it's getting covered up by the clouds? I still get comments in my old videos like the clouds are still. They never move. The whole clouds have shifted over top my cursor. And they're still, still moving from left to right. The clouds do move in this game. I I always respond. I, I don't usually respond to those comments. But the other day I did. I was like, yes, they do. They're like, no, they don't. I'm like, yes, they do. <laughs> look, look at my cursor at the top of the screen there. The clouds have shifted a mile, but I get so many comments in my old videos. Like, I can't believe the clouds don't move. For one, I've never paid attention to that in games, to be honest. It's never something I ever look for, but I'm like, they do move. <laughs> Which is pretty cool, but it's also like, those comments always, I'm like, what do you mean they don't move? Just put your finger on the screen and you can see that it does, right? Maybe they've maybe they're always joking. You never know. And can we get there in two? Wait a second. Okay, Malahan. I see what you did here. Is this one of those platinum tour routes? Those players that are really good, they can take these routes and shoot the gap. But look at out of bounds to the right. But here's the thing. I got a simple question for you, YouTube. Do you want to win? Or do you want to lose? I'm going for it. I believe this one's fairway bound. John said fairway. It's probably going in the rough. Sorry, John. Never mind. John's right. Everybody remain calm. You all know what's coming. Second shot on the 18th. Okay. Bonus eyes closed. Officially declaring a bonus eyes closed dedication to the legend, Il Malahan, for designing this stunning golf course. I mean, to be fair, my eyes open dedications have not been good, so eyes closed can't hard to be much worse, to be honest. 260 downhill five wind at her back. That's when you know the swing is off, but you you think you have a better shot eyes closed than open. <laughs> this has been such a fun showcase. This might have been one of my most fun showcases. I feel like I've just been having a good time. You know, you all, I hope, are having a good time, too. Appreciate you all. We have fun in these course showcase videos. You know, we just play golf, stress-free, have a good time, and hit good shot dedications. Like, Albie, bonus, eyes closed. For you, Malahan, wherever you are on the World Wide Web, this one's for you. I've redeemed myself for pronouncing that wrong. Fumbling on those words earlier. Got it right twice in a row. Here we go. Is that something to brag about? Hey, I said World Wide Web right. <laughs> I got it right this time. That's what I told tell my wife after this video. I got it right. You mean you pronounce it wrong the first time? No comment. Okay, here we go. Let's get focused. Come on. 
Enough joking around, Ryan. Enough talk. More golf. This was for you, Malahan. Clear the mechanism. Come on. Just another day at the office, Ryan. Multiple major champion. He's done it all. Felt really, really good. Not sure where this one's going to end up. Oh, no, John. Don't say that. Rut row. You're kidding. Oh, that's too bad. Did John just say rut this row? Is what our third shot's looking like. What? 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 Wait, wait, wait a second. Where in the world are we? It felt good. Remember when I said it can't be much worse? Well, yes, it can. So I was here. And it felt great, but somehow it went here. Did we hit? Oh, a squirrel took it, right? I think a squirrel ran across the screen. I... <laughs> It's going to be so entertaining for me watching this back when I edit to see where, like, how in the world did I do that? I am shocked. How is that even possible? What just, what, what just happened? That one's for you, Malahan. Hope you enjoyed it. Glad to see shot dedication still work for Malahan, so things don't, some things don't change. But we can still dedicate this eagle. Hey, it's not out of bounds. Thank you, Malahan. Okay, close the eyes. Focus up. This one's for you, Malahan. Can't do much worse. <laughs> Isn't that the truth? Felt really good. John, talk. Talk to me, John. Okay, here's your fourth. That's all. I am lost out here at Cornucopia. This course... I, I don't even know what's going on right now. Okay, this one's for you, Malahan. You know, this is going to be a surprise to nobody, but it's really hard to get distance control when you play with your eyes closed. Be yeah, believe it or not. That. Oh, never mind. It's, but yeah, it's believe it or not, when you can't see the club going back, it's all instincts. So it's hard to get that distance control right, believe it or not. I would not recommend playing with the eyes closed. The good news is, is a bonus eyes closed par... And we still have 90% fairway chance. Realize, we've hit a lot of fairways today. I would not be surprised if it's sitting at 90. We've been, lo we've been locked in. Dialed in on fairway percent. So, at least we still have that going for us. Looking good. That one's for you, Malahan. Yeah, How, what points are we par on? As this one comes to an end. Seven, unofficially. With that, I will leave you with Eight. This. Officially seven. My heartfelt gratitude for picking the game up in the first place. and That was a exceptional round of golf. 76 fairways. I will take it. I felt like it was better than that. Uh, but 66 girls. Malahan is... Uh, his courses are tough, but they are amazing. This course was fantastic from start to finish. 1.28 putts per hole. Huh. That's amazing. It's because we missed a lot of greens. Did we wait? We weren't making putts today. Did we? Have, we had one chip in. I'm actually really surprised to see 1.28 putts per hole. A 67 four under. That is an easy favorite. That is an easy five star. Amazing.
And let's take a look at the scorecard here. Cornucopia by Malahan was phenomenal. And that is a one under on the front with the dedicated double an unofficially dedicated bogey on eight, then an official birdie dedication as well on the front. A lot of a lot of exciting dedications on the front nine. And then on the back nine, we birdie, bogeyed, birdie. We had a birdie dedication. Which hole was that? Was that number 10? Was the birdie dedication on 10? Oh no, we didn't. No, it was the four. It, we parred 14. It was the par dedication. We didn't make the birdie. We lipped out. Yeah, that's right. That was another par dedication. Then we, we, some might say that final par dedication was just as sweet as a birdie or eagle because of how it happened. Just think. Eyes closed. Shanked it to the right. Under swung. Perfect flop. In for par. I feel like that had to be a very satisfying shot for Malahan to watch or a satisfying golf hole. Uh, you know. I mean, at least I say that. Maybe when I watch it back, I might say something completely different. But what a golf course. Amazing design here from Il Malahan. Get on out there. Play this course. Let me know how you shoot in a comment down below. Make sure you make better decisions than I did today. And make sure you dedicate an ace to Ilm Malahan. If you got some enjoyment, be sure to drop a like. It really helps the channel. Subscribe for more, plenty more content to tune into here on the Gamer Ability YouTube channel. Tons of PGA, PGA 2K23 stuff and plenty of other sports game content. We have 10 ongoing career mode series right now at the same time. Career modes, dynasties, uh, you name it, we've got it. I'll see you next time. As always, have a fantastic day, everybody.